Aramas Andresian Sr. entered a plea of not guilty to the charge he murdered his little boy, even though multiple sources have confirmed to Fox 11 that it was he who told detectives where they could find his little boy's body. Wearing a jail-issued suicide prevention gown, Aramaz Dandresian Sr. faced a judge today, entering a plea of not guilty to the charge he murdered his little boy just hours after they left Disneyland. A bail will be $10 million. Ara Andresian Jr. had been missing for 71 days when his body was found by police Friday evening. The five-year-old found just north of Lake Kachuma, off of Vista Point in Santa Barbara County. If there is any small consolation, it's that his body has been found and he can, you know, get a proper burial. The discovery coming just hours after his father returned to Los Angeles in police custody, after being extradited from Las Vegas, where police said he spent 47 days partying and socializing. Never once, say police, did Andresian Sr. cooperate in the search for his son until Friday afternoon, when sources confirmed to Fox 11 he told police where little Ara's body was. We asked his defense attorney about that. GG, that has to do with the facts of the case, and I'm on under court order not to talk about the facts of the case. Ara Jr.'s mother, Ana Estevez, was in court this morning after spending the weekend in seclusion, surrounded by family and friends mourning the loss of her only child. And even though detectives with the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department told her weeks ago they believed her son was dead, she had held out hope until the very end. I can't believe this is happening. He took something that is so precious, not just from our family, but from everybody who's been following this and helping us get through the situation. He's devastated the family. He's devastated people who've never met my nephew. It's unbelievable. It's unreal. Aramaz Andresian Sr. is due back in court on August 16th. In Alhambra, Gigi Graciette, Fox 11 News.